Good morning, everyone. Welcome to another vlog. Um, so, this week, um, I've got loads to do this week actually, and it's so much warmer in here, so I feel like I'm so much more productive. <laughs> I am not productive when it's cold, I just stand here and feel sorry for myself. Um, so, before I go on with the vlog, I thought I'd show you the new um, puffin mug. This is a really limited edition one because I want it. I don't normally do like Valentine's things, but um, I thought it'd be really nice to like intertwine it with what I do, like illustrate creatures. And um, I was researching British birds um, that were quite sort of sweet looking and I do get a lot of people asking for puffin mugs. Um, and anyway, puffins are one of the most romantic breeds, apparently. Uh, they make for life and they are just so cute. So here is the puffin mug. It's a very limited edition. I'm, by the time you watch this, it's already available to pre-order, but the shipping date will be on the listing. Um, but it's gonna be a pretty quick turnaround time. So let me grab it. Oh, is it focusing? Isn't that just the cutest thing? Oh, oh, there we go. Isn't that the sweetest thing? Heart, gold hearts all the way around. And then these guys. I'll link the product down below. Um, but yeah, very sweet. So it's made with speckled um, toasted clay and then a white glaze over the top. Um, and then yeah, the illustrated puffins. So sweet. I love them. Um, but yeah, other than that, I am, I've got a couple of meetings early next week that I need to prepare for. I've got kilns to load, unload. I've got something in the works that um, I'll talk to you guys more about next week. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's start the vlog. everyone I have just trimmed and stamped oh we're a bit speckly because this isn't very clean the bottom of all of these these are all tumblers these are all gonna be mugs I've just broken one which is annoying because then that takes me down to nine but these are actually a tester for something I have coming up soon um, very soon actually other than that I've got my planters that need to go in for a bisque firing these are testers for a chef I'm meeting next week. Um, and this is for Glass and Wick. This is a 3D print, and this is the original. Yeah, so this needs, this needs a good tidy up before we go into the kiln, but yeah, it's been a nice, slow but busy day. Slow, I'm just not rushing about, and my replay. Thank you. 
I really like this. Very subtle, but very sweet. I love it. I really like this. Very nice. Know how this was going to come out because the brown was well, brownie green. So where it's thicker, you can see on the top there. But nice. I really like that. Yay. Okay. Now I'm going to get out some sample mugs for something really cool slash scary slash exciting that's going to happen. Oh, wow. Well, disaster, but look at those colours. Oh my God. Okay, well, that is beautiful. Mm, I don't know what to do about this, but yay success successful sample i mean it's fucking excuse me very pretty this one looks good too oh my god this is i'm not going to tell you what's happening or what these are for um you'll just have to wait and see but big yay Big yay, followed by a big, oh, I'm so cross about this. It's on an old bit of plate, but it's a diffuser that has run really badly. I've had a nightmare with this glaze. Oh, and they've cha they've obviously changed the recipe and they are saying they haven't, but I've never had so many issues. So, yeah, anyway. I hope you enjoyed my uh, semi very successful uh, slash really, well, it wasn't disastrous, but there was a couple of things that were not how they were supposed to come out. See you soon. Hey, Boosh, hey, Jen. <laughs>